Hi, welcome to my Dollar Tree haul. And yep, I'm back again. Um, this time I found a couple new finds, you know. It's not the same old, same old, so. Um, but I did see these um, Elf Smudge Pot 21693 Got a Glow. This one right here, and I'm going to try it on right now so you guys can see how it looks. Hold on. I, I might do a swatch of it. Okay. And it's called Got a Glow. This is it right here. It's the elf. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Okay. Right there. Okay. Let's see. Okay. We're, I'm going to do a swatch. And on my skin, it's kind of. See? All right, yeah, and um, let me try it on my eye. Yeah, I love it. It's kind of a, it looks like a gold kind of, and it's not too, you know, like when you put these on, they're like kind of cr too creamy. It goes on really nice. It looks like it's able to blend well, and you can see it. It looks kind of like a gold color. Okay, and then the other one that I got is Smudge Pot Cruising Chick 21695. And I'll show you how this one is the swatch of this one. I'm trying it right here. Let me see if I can get it to go on. See right there. Let me do another one. And that's a nice color. And that one, I would probably do that one in my corners right here and in here. And let me try that. Yeah. It, I like that color too. And you know, you can just, just blend it in. And it would look nice. And then I got the banana chips because I didn't want to eat anything too junky. So I got a bag of these and you get like a whole bag. It's naturally flavored six ounces in the back so I picked up those and then I picked up a ponytail holder you just put it your hair up in a ponytail like this you put this in and it, and then you just tuck it tuck the hair underneath here and it looks cute you know it has like a cute little ponytail on top and then you could just leave like some of your hairs down in the front or just have the, I had the whole hair up and just put this in and it holds your hair pretty well because I've tried it before and then I got this oatmeal verbana soap and I'm going to open this you guys this is like I think this one has like a lemony smell and oatmeal and it's a nice I'm going to put it in my bathroom it's a nice smell to it and I just got a pumpkin one so I thought that was nice and then I found this merengue perfume. Picked up two of these. I got one, two. And um, I love this perfume. And I think I like it better than the Blossom Blast. But I'll tell you what it smells like. Here's the bottle and the cap. I'll tell you what this smells like, guys. <laughs> Can't believe I'm in Dollar Tree again. It smells like an expensive um, perfume, and I would say it kind of compares to um, the Justin Bieber Girlfriend. I like it. And um, it compares to uh, Can Can by Paris Hilton. And um, some other people hauled this one, the Merengue, and they said that it was really close to the Paris Hilton perfume and it's it does have a nice expensive smell and they had it in there when Blossom Blast was in there and um and the one by Vera Wang and um they it was in Dollar Tree and then they took it out for a while and then it's hard to find those and then I found it again and those are like my favorite ones okay so then I got these um they're starting to have Christmas things in there so I got these cute they're stickers snowflakes i'm gonna use them to make my jewelry and you can see these on my web page you're gonna see these with my jewelry in there it's gonna turn out really cute 
and I'm making a board for my business so I got this paper here it's um, five sheets and I swear you are going to pay probably three dollars four dollars in Walmart for this pack and it's poster board the smaller one 11 by 14 inches so I'm going to make a little board I didn't want it too big so I'm just going to make a small board and this is going to be the borderline and I got these for the background in there because I'm selling jewelry so I have to kind of make it look girly and sparkly <laughs> you know and I need a child's hanger and they had some of them loose I think it's supposed to be like five in the pack for a dollar but I really needed it bad so I just went ahead and got this for the dollar and it's hard to find the kids hangers you know because I've got some kids clothes that um, really nice um, designer clothes that I'm gonna be putting it on my site so I needed this hanger for this and then I needed um, these to mail like large purses and this for like smaller purses so I got one two three four five of these and these are very nice for melon items. Um, it really locks really well. Um, I looked it up at, uh, at Staples and they were selling the same bag for $3.49 for one and the smaller bag was $1.69. So I got all those for a dollar each. So then I thought this pencil sharpener, I thought it was so cute. They had different ones but I was like this is cute you know. So then um, I put it back and I wasn't going to get it, but then I saw this light, this night light. I'm going to put it in my bathroom, and I was like, I like soccer, so I'm going to put these in my bathroom because I like soccer, and sometimes I watch it on TV, so I like it. I thought that was cute. They went together, and then I saw this. I'm going to open this one if I can. It's for my iPhone 6 and um this is the case guys and you can put the you can keep the case i might need the case for something i'm going to keep the case but um it comes with um wipes to clean your iphone and i've got the 6s plus and it also comes with this drop cloth in there and this is really nice quality you put this on your iphone and it has this um, protection for your iPhone. You put it on there and you stick it on your iPhone. This is it. If you have the 6X, 6S or 6S Plus, it's the screen guard. And if you get that in the Apple Store, you're going to be paying a whole, 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 whole lot more. So I got those. And I can't believe I'm back in the Dollar Tree, guys. And, you get, and then this is another one. First aid kit, guys. Needed this for my car. Because not just the car. I need it for the house, too, or just in my purse. And it comes with antiseptic wipes. Um, two little, a couple of little band-aids. And it has two small band-aids. You know, you can always refill these, you know, like if you get cut, the round ones. And it has uh, a couple band-aids in there. And you can put, like, what you want in there that fits in the small thing. But I think it's a good idea to have a little first aid kit. So this is that. And then I got this makeup remover. And somebody hauled this on, um one of their Dollar Trees and they said that it was pretty good quality and they got some like it in Walmart and it worked just as good so um, I'm gonna try it out and then maybe I'll do a product review on it and it's by Sassy and Chic the eye makeup remover and then I found this nice brush I was like you know I love that and I had to pick up some more Wet n Wild. Whoops, excuse me, guys. Sorry about that. More Wet n Wild brushes right here. So I got a couple of them, and they're hard to find them now. So 
This Dollar Tree is different than the one I went to yesterday. The one I went to yesterday didn't hardly have anything, but they had the new breast cancer things, and that's why I did that little mini haul, because I wanted to show you guys that. And then I said, let me go down to the other new one. So, you know, everybody's into Mandela. So I got this one with the crosses, and I thought that was so cute. And some of these I'm going to use for my jewelry design. Look at that. That's not, that looks kind of Moroccan, and my friend is from Morocco. So, this looks a little bit Moroccan, and this is um, a cross. I needed something for designs for my jewelry, and I'm going to do something similar, like make necklaces with that. And especially Christmas is coming up, that's going to be a good idea. Here's another one. And here's another one of the crosses. This one with the crosses is really nice, gorgeous. I really love it. And I'm, um, you know, I can't wait to get color in it because I'm going to do my colors in there so I know what design and what colors to use in my jewelry. And I also work with glass, crystals, um, polymer clay when I make my jewelry so I can all use all those mediums to make this and also I could use it as a background design for um, my board that I'm making this is nice really gorgeous pictures and you know if you just sit there and you just color these if you get stressed out this is the best thing to relieve stress and it's creative. It can get your creative creativity out. If you don't feel you're creative, you can still do it. You know, color it, and then you'll see. You say, "Oh shoot, I didn't know I could do that." You know, when you're done, because the colors will turn out really nice when you do these mandalas. Now I'm making mandala stones too, so I might put this on my stone. And then I got the one with the angels. The angels are really cute. And you guys are going to love these for Christmas. Um, you could have your kids coloring with you. You know, do family events around the table. Get a couple of these. And this is more like a coloring book. But it has mandala in there too. So you guys, these pictures are beautiful. It's gorgeous. You can make cards. There's all kinds of possibilities. But I'm using it for my jewelry designs. You know, and I'm going to use it for backgrounds. Very nice pictures. And these are coming out because Christmas is, is going to be here soon. So that's why um, these are coming out. And you guys, you really have to pick up some of these and do these with your kids and have family time together that would be nice and here's another like mandala type one you know it has the, the designs and I really I love this one but I love the crosses because the designs was so interesting so then um, oh I'm sorry you guys sorry I am messing up this video with the camera I I'm sorry for that anyhow <laughs> okay I got these tablecloths this one is for when I'm doing my crafts around the table I don't want to mess up my, my stuff so I just drop put the drop cloth on there if you're doing your nails you know anything that's messy painting you can put it as a drop cloth on your table and then use it and then I got these and I'm gonna use these for wrapping my my um, items that I'm mailing out. I'm going to use some of this for that too. And I did last night and it turned out really nice. And I got this LA Colors and they didn't have my color before. It was a lighter color and it's a liquid makeup. And this is like if you're on the go and you need like a touch up. And it's uh, this one is tan. They have my color now. And I'll just open it and uh, let me see how this is on my hand. Let's see. 
Yeah, that's that that would be like my color, you know, right there. I'm gonna put it on my face a little bit. And the consistency, as you know, these are like kind of like if you blend it in with some powder, it's okay, but the LA colors they still have their stuff a little too you know, it's like too much it's too wet, you know. But it does it does the job, you know, like if you're like trying to hurry up quick and go on the go, then this is really good. I really like this smudge pot one. This one showed up really like you could see it on my skin pretty good and I'm kind of dark so complexed. So this one, you know, it showed up too, but it you know, I had to I have to blend it and I have to use like darker colors right here because of my dark complexion. Um, and also they've got the uh, Carmex. This is nice to have because um, I think I looked in CVS and it was um, like two or three dollars for it but it was only a dollar and it was the same one and I was like I needed this. So <clears throat> I got the uh, stones again and this one has the clear. It's got the blue one and it has the green one in there like that see right there and I'm gonna do some stuff with that and then I'm gonna make some Hello Kitty necklaces and I'm making them out of polymer clay and the head is gonna be yeah, I'm gonna do that probably the head and the body I saw some cute ideas and I'm gonna make it out of polymer clay for kids and I'm gonna put this on the necklace and I thought that was really cute and these are in the craft section but the, the other Dollar Tree didn't hardly have anything so I went to this one and um, what this one has the other one don't have and you know vice versa but you know you can go to both of them and then you'll see you know that's what I'm gonna do next time but they have th this in the craft section and it's um, elastic so I'm gonna use that for the necklace use this for part of the the um, necklace and I'm gonna make the rest out of polymer clay and it's gonna be Hello Kitty and I thought that was gonna be cute and there's one that is a teddy bear and if you guys don't know what kawaii is it's those little characters from Japan and they look like Hello Kitty or Hello Kitty friends and you know you can put it on necklaces for little kids and adults wear them too because they are so cute the characters are cute and I'm gonna make some and next time when I do my video um, I'm gonna put it on there. So I'm sorry for the camera rolling like that, you know, I just get too excited sometimes. <laughs> Especially when it comes to kids stuff, I'm like a big kid. Okay, so then when it was the craft section, I went in there, you get 20 glue sticks for a dollar. And you guys know that, if you, you know, you, you always need the um, glue sticks and a glue gun for something. Repairs around the house, crafts, you know, you need it for, uh, anything you know you use a glue gun but um they do have 20 mini glue sticks in this bag for just one dollar one dollar no holla okay so they have these these uh glue sticks is four of them and this is a different kind of glue sticks and my daughter used to cut up magazines and use these and she used to make like little murals and now she's doing paintings of murals and oh yeah by the way this is my daughter's painting right there Jasmine that's her painting over there and I had to force her to do it I was like can you please do it because she came up here to visit me you know and then she wanted to go back to Florida with grandma so she was like I said okay so just do this for me before you leave and I had to force her to do it and then she finally did it anywho okay okay these are um I just seen these in the craft section and um, I don't know what I'm gonna it's called paper pennant and they had white triangles too and I don't know what you use these for I guess you could use it for like a flag making a flag or something I don't know but I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna use it for I might use it for like when I make my stones use it for designs on the back like if you put the paint on the back and you and you use this as a design then it looks 3D when you look at it with the glass and then you can just paint 
the um, your clear over it and then use the stone as a necklace so and then I got this anti-frizz VO5 and I love this stuff I thought it wasn't gonna be any good because it was a dollar but it has argan oil in it and my hair is dry and so I use I got both of these and also that that Shia leave-in is excellent and I saw a girl haul it on her video and she had like nice curls and stuff and she was putting the Shia in there and it just sprung back and I was like wow you know I was, I was like it, it looks cute and it looks nice and she said it smelled good so I put you have to only put a little bit in because it'll make your hair wet just put a little in your palm and then put it in and leave it in and it did smell good and made your hair look nice and smooth so that was pretty good just because it's a dollar doesn't mean it's any it's not any good so I got this uh Chlor and Danvor and I love the love love this body wash and you know you guys just seem like you're my family you guys just seem like I've been on here for over uh, over so many years um please subscribe you know and I'll keep making my videos and it, I've just been on here I started watching Modiva and I was like man I want to be like her you know and then I watched Pretty and Flaw and I was like god I want to be like her and then Boss Babe J I watched her and I was like, yeah, I want to be like her, you know, but um, she only did like a couple videos and I think she had a bunch of them on and then she uh, took them off. But anyway, um, this video is long, so I'm trying to move along. Okay, this one is the Daiquiri Punch and Resort Candle and it looks like this and yes, it smells smells so beautiful it smells like you're on the beach and like it's Hawaiian punch you know and it just smells smells like you're sitting on the beach with your umbrella chilling drinking Hawaiian punch with ice and it's really hot out and the waves are coming up oh yes and it even looks like it just has that feeling you know <laughs> it's like wow I got I got a light lit candle I just love candles you know it just puts me in a very nice mood and then I was as you guys can see I was mainly in the craft section I'm slowing down on getting the makeup because um I have too much right now and I might be giving away some of them so I got too much last year and the year before so um this is the craft storage box and I haven't seen anybody haul any of these these look like they're new they had the clear ones and the, you've seen the ones that I had it was the, uh, the the tool ones this is how it looks inside and this is another one it's not it's nice it's not the quality is good you can put your craft in there I'm gonna put my beads in there and and I have gemstone beads that I use to um, and I'm really getting to a more advanced stage of beading when I started out I just started doing it like as a hobby and just doing like single strands and now I'm getting into the right angle weaving and uh, more technical <laughs> you know beading and um, this is gonna be for advertisement because I make like Chanel like jewelry but you're not allowed to put Chanel on there because it's copyrighted but you can have like a little picture and it says Chanel and then you can set your jewelry out and take a photo of it and put it on there and then um, you can do that but as long as you don't have like Chanel inspired or Chanel on there then you won't get in trouble for that you can just have like a small little picture like here you know just sitting out but your jewelry setting out that looks like Chanel. So I was I was getting into that um, like last year, and I'm going to get back into it because with my job it was getting so stressful at Boeing, and I was just you know um, I really got to get back into my eBay because I it, it's something that I like to do, and it's my artwork that I'm presenting you know that you know I have it on there. And also, I have um, 
like designer clothes that are pre-owned and stuff on there on the site so check out my site if you want to and um, it'll be listed in the link below and um, I'm gonna start linking other people there was a young girl that I saw and I typed in funny Dollar Tree videos and she was on there and I really thought it was funny and she was at the Dollar Tree and she was like you know just joking around and playing around with like things in there and she was like um, running to Target you know and comparing the prices and it was like so funny because she wasn't taking it like so serious you know so I thought that was interesting so if I can find her link I'll link her down to the bottom and you guys gotta watch her she was hilarious so um, yes thank you uh, for watching my um, video and I do feel like you guys are family and I'm trying to get around to watch all of your videos and I'm gonna try to subscribe and make comments and everything so thank you for watching and I might have a giveaway on my next video. I just wasn't prepared for it on this one. I was just trying to hurry up, rush. I had a lot of stuff to do. So thank you for watching and um, I'll see you on my next haul. It should be probably maybe the end of September or the beginning of October. So thank you very much for watching.